Benjamin Franklin is credited with the statement if you fail to plan you are planning to fail it's something few of us would disagree with and yet in many of the ICOs which I study the idea of failure is barely touched upon it's automatically assumed that the soft cap will be reached then the hard cap and all the promised technology rich environment will come good too almost overnight one of the first tests I do when I read an ICO white paper is to try and assess is this realistic in other words are the deliverables truly deliverable or is there an element of failure in build from that follows an assessment of how these things can be measured if there's a roadmap then at least there are way markers laid down by which various goals should have been achieved so at least we know what the founders are planning to do or rather hoping to do they are certainly not planning to fail but their plans to succeed often seems optimistic at best a very interesting financial ICO which I am an advisor to at the moment has an entirely refreshing approach in their pre-ICO playbook they absolutely plan to succeed and I'm sure they will but in doing so they look very closely at the threats and potential weaknesses in their planning they do this to such a significant point that about one quarter of the playbook is devoted to examining what could just possibly go wrong now some marketing advisors would say that this is entirely the wrong approach we should always be picking up the product or service and sweeping objections under the carpet how can inward investment ever be attracted if we are talking in such depth about difficulties perhaps that's why the SS Titanic was built as unsinkable on the other hand an ICO which takes a clear-eyed look at potential difficulties rather than through rose tinted glasses will always get my vote honesty and transparency always play well by addressing the difficulties the ICO can then point to solutions and it's also a great way to engage with the target audience what do you think about this give us your feedback of course there's a big difference between an ICO white paper which is open and transparent about the bumps which will be encountered along the road and an ICO which denies that there will be any bumps the midpoint is where the ICO team acknowledge the threats to success but already has the strategic answers and know what their tactics will be when or if a problem does occur so do I mind it when an ICO team talk about potential problems along the way not at all but there is only one proviso they have to have a suite of solutions too and by the way the Benjamin Franklin code I began with is also attributed to the writer Alan Lacken and the statesman Winston Churchill so someone failed to plan as far as getting their name recorded in the greatest quotes of all time library and you can quote me on that